Hi Sag, it's L here to do your March 2019 general reading. It's a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every Sagittarius who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Thank you for those who continuously keep coming back. Um, this is a busy time for me in my life, so I'm kind of in and out, all right? Uh, things will slow down, and I'll have more consistency, okay? But here I am, okay? So, let's see what's going on with Sag. What's the situation for Sag? Okay. What's the advice for Sagittarius? What's the energy of the partner or the person that Sagittarius is coming to the reading for? the outcome for Sagittarius all right the lovers under the deck we have the king of wands in reverse Ooh. so mm, the Sagittarius The Sagittarius is normally after whatever it is they want, what they desire, their heart's desire. And they're trying to, you know, keep that in line in regards to other people that play a part in their life. Because none of us is, no one person is an island. So Sag tries to keep that in mind. But this is the King of Wands in reverse. So this is a person who is only after what it is they want. Uh, what it is they desire they have a thought they go after it it does they do not take into account other people what people say what people their their judgments nothing this is um an unconventional person too this is this could be a promiscuous person I mean this is a person who does a completely what they want okay um this could be you sad this could be someone you're dealing with all right the situation is the world okay so 100 percent completion you're at the end now you, now you should jump to the full correct let's see uh the world this could be in regards to Cycles. A cycle in your life has ended, has changed. Something shifted here. Cycle is typically seven years. It's typically, you know, it doesn't have to be. But a cycle has shifted, it's changed. Uh, this is the 21 card. Seven, right? Seven, you know. Um, Something about prayers answered. Something about the third time. Three. A, a chapter has ended. Something's ended. Maybe in regards to Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Not, excuse me. Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio. Taurus okay your advice is the king of cups in reverse okay so your advice is to so the king of cups upright right he is this is all male energy you know I, this could be female whatever um but this is male energy uh the king of cups upright keeps likes to keep exes around it feeds the ego so they like to hold on to their emotions and they release or they allow emotional display when comfortable uh, or when necessary 
The King of Cups in reverse also could be emotionally manipulative. The advice here is to release exes. Stop being emotionally manipulative. Become emotionally mature. The King of Cups and the King of Wands in reverse. You, that affirmation is I want. You know, the King of Wands upright and the affirmation of the King of Cups is um, I feel. You are listening to your intuition. The advice is listen to your intuition. Release. Be emotionally mature about a particular situation, okay? How your partner feels or a person you're coming to the reading for. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. They they rescind all effort to build upon whatever it is they have with you. They don't want to do it. It took them a while to even get to a place of trusting the relationship, the situation to even offer the night, I mean offer the pentacle, but now they they take it back. They rescind all of this because this is maybe the Sagittarius is not acting in the right manner. Or Sag, this could be some, how somebody's acting with you. The outcome is the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Or it's just um, you need to make the choice. Particularly it's in love or about love. Um, it's a life choice. Make the choice. You have been brought together with a particular someone to further the relationship. It's been you've been brought to gather by way of the universe God angel spirit but we still have free will we still can choose whatever however elsewhere right so you have to make the choice what is it okay so let's open up the reading just a little bit um this is a fair and balanced choice whatever that may be for you only you know Okay, the Ten of Cups just flew out the deck. We're going to put it back. The world. Can you clarify the world? Okay. The Four of Cups. Somebody is closing out a cycle. It, it, we can go no further here because it, I'm, I feel like I'm either going to get more of the same. I am dreadfully bored. I am tired. I don't. I'd rather be the Three of Cups. I'd rather party, have fun, be with friends, be with family, date. I do not want that fourth cup of stability. I don't want it. I want to close out this cycle. Uh, this could be with the Water Sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sagittarius. Give me one more card. Nine, and then the single card this is a this is a situation where there's a particular Sagittarius who wants to be independent of you fill in the blank wants to be free of you fill in the blank um, who wants to be separate from maybe the ten of pentacles or the Ten of Cups that we just saw. Um, they don't want the whole family life. They did it one time maybe. Now they don't want it. They want to be free of this. Okay. Um, Alright. King of Cups in reverse. Strength card. The Fool. Alright. Yeah, this is tame yourself. This is a person, King of Cups in reverse, King of Wands in reverse. Tame yourself. Get 
in control of yourself. Um, you are maybe out of control in, in regards to what it is you, you want. Tame that inner wild beast, that, that lion. Tame yourself. Have the strength to have the energy and effort to put it elsewhere. Be like the fool and start over or chart a new path. You've been on this path too long. One where you may be emotionally manipulative, one where you may be promiscuous, one where you may be um, not showing emotion when you should or not showing it in the correct fashion. Ace of Pentacles. Start anew. Like zero card and then the ace. Nice. New business, new home, large purchase. Something foundational that you can build upon. Start this. Put your energy and effort into something else. You're not. The advice here is you are not emotionally fulfilled. Therefore, you act out. Have the strength to either end something and go a new path to start something new. The world again. Five of Swords. You might have to deal with something from your past before you can move forward. You want to be the fool, the world, then the fool, then the world. Again, the advice here is allow something to end. A cycle that you've been dealing with 20 years, 20 year cycle, 21, three or more years. <clears throat> you've dealt with it with three different men, three different women. I don't know. You something about a fixed sign that interferes with in what you try to build. This could be family, this could be passing judgment, this could be gossip. Your partner is the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Let's see. The Emperor. Be an older man. Be grandfather also. Knight of Wands, the son. He wants to move. This person wants to explore their options also now. Could be a Taurus. Could be an Aries. Something has been enlightened. There has been enlightenment about maybe the Sagittarius or about trying to turn this relationship around. So now, yeah, something about the family dynamic with the Sagittarius. This person was all in at one time. Now they are the Page of Pentacles. It's just messages of, you know, well, we could do this or we could have done that or I'm up for or, you know, to the King of Cups could be you, Sag, you coming up as the King of Cups up right here. They pop this it could be a water sign they want to reconcile with you. you want to reconcile with someone else 
they want to continue to create with you. Something came out. Something was illuminated. They rescinded their offer because you were hell bent, stuck on doing things your way. You were in and out. You did what you wanted. You were all over the place. They needed positivity and light. This was illuminated to them about you. About maybe this is it's just not going to work. They allow for their happiness to come in. And it, it might be that they. They walked away from you. Or you walked away from them. Or they were walking away. You offered an apology. Yeah. Because you're trying to hold on. To status. Somebody's watching. Somebody has this rumor and gossip and now Sad is trying to fix situation only because there's somebody watching. But Sad really wants to be single and wants to be without a uh, heavy burden or obligation. The lovers and the outcome. The Ten of Wands, yeah. Laying down a burden, allowing a complete ending. Uh, you got to make the choice to lay down a burden. Four of Wands. It could be the burden of a relationship. It could be the burden of building. The choice to lay down burden. Allow complete ending surrounding something that used to be solid and stable. Communicating exactly how you feel or what you know about a situation that allows for a new start. Two of swords, knowing intuitively which way you should go. Allow yourself to stay blind, blindfolded in regards to the other woman. But something gets found out. Sad. There's like somebody outside of the relationship. You need to make a choice. It looks like if you don't. You get found out anyhow. Because you start to offer something to this other person. This is a... Two different situations for some of you you're staying together out of obligation because there's rumor the rumor mill you're more concerned about what other people have to say you need to let something end here there's an ending that needs to happen uh, for some of you uh, you were staying in something out of obligation but there was someone on the outside who you really wanted to be with and now you're offering your cup of love romance to this person but you get found out um and then it allows you to go into hermit mode and you got to think about what it is you really want because you're separated from what you truly desire and so there's a lot of acting out and there's a lot of outbursts and emotional turmoil um, I am not able to go after what I desire what I want what I feel or who I feel is best for me you're ready ask others for help perfect timing success meditation brings answers forgiveness opportunity all right so there it is. Meditation brings answers about this. Some of you want forgiveness in regards to um, some of you need to ask for forgiveness. Some of you 
you being very, very selfish, but you won't leave a person because there are other people looking, looking at the relationship. And you don't want to hear that. I told you so. You don't want to hear the, you don't want the rumor mill to be true. Nine of fire, the moon, and the strength card. Bottom of the deck, the lovers again. Got to make a choice. Because you're on the outs with someone who you really want to be with. You have deep emotion for this Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You'd have the strength to move this forward or to completely be done with it. Because right now you are, you need to make the choice. Whoever you're dealing with knows about the other person. But they're still holding on to the relationship because of money and or status. You really want to be somewhere else with someone else. It's a big old mess. Anyhow, um, Sag, if this resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. This month, no extended readings, but I am offering a $5 yes or no question reading. So if you have a yes or no question, go ahead and take advantage of that. You can't beat that. Um, the extended reading was $1.75. Spend a little bit more to get a personalized yes or no answer, right? Take advantage of that. The link is below or go and book a full reading. Go over to the website and book a reading that is best suited for you. Sag, know that I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.